Helicopters in the military perform a variety of roles. Some are built specifically for speed and attack, while others offer transport and support functions. While utility military helicopters are capable of fulfilling both, it can fill roles such as ground attack, air assault, military logistics, casualty evacuation, medical evacuation, command and control, and troop transport. So amongst all the utility helicopters available today, the Buzz will present the top 10 utility military helicopters in the world. Without further ado, let's get started. Up first at number 10 is the Eurocopter EC-725 Caracal. Currently known as the Airbus Helicopters H-225M, it is a multinational military long-range tactical transport helicopter. This utility twin-engined aircraft is capable of transporting up to 28 seated soldiers and two crew members. It is designed for troop transport, casualty evacuation, and combat search and rescue missions. It is armed with 7.62mm machine guns and can also be equipped with sight-mounted 68mm rocket pods. This multi-mission helicopter is capable for search and rescue missions at all hours of the day and night because of its well-advanced radar. The ninth best utility helicopter today is the Z-18. This is a new Chinese utility helicopter. The Z-18 is powered by three WZ-6C turboshaft engines, developing around 1,752 shaft horsepower each. The maximum and cruising speeds of these helicopters are 336 km per hour and 265 km per hour, while the range and service ceiling of the helicopter are 900 km and 9 km respectively. It is equipped with an electro-optic or infrared sensor, a dipping sonar, and a chin-mounted surface search radar. It can carry up to 32 Sanabui and four YU-7 lightweight ASW torpedoes or YJ-9 anti-ship missiles. At number 8, we have the Westland Sea King, which is a British license-built version of the American Sikorsky S-61 helicopter. This is powered by two Rolls-Royce Gnome H1400 turboshaft engines, which develops 1,400 shaft horsepower each. The maximum speed of this helicopter is 208 km per hour. The range and service ceiling of the Westland Sea King is 1,230 km and 3.04 km respectively. This utility helicopter can carry four torpedoes either ATK Mark 46, Whitehead A244S, or BAE System Stingray torpedoes. It can also be armed with four MK-11 DEF charges and is able to carry two anti-ship missiles, either Sea Eagle or Exocet. At number 7, we have the Augusta Westland AW-159 Wildcat. This is designed to serve in the battlefield utility, search and rescue, and anti-surface warfare and anti-submarine roles. The helicopter can carry CRV-7 or other unoperated rockets. It can carry four Thales Martlet lightweight multi-role air-to-surface missiles, and alternatively, it can also carry four Sea Venom lightweight anti-ship missiles. These weapons are effective against small boats and fast attack craft. Both of these missiles can target ships and land targets. The naval version can also carry two Stingray torpedoes or DEF charges, and it is powered by two LHTEC CTS-800 4N turboshaft engines, developing 1,361 shaft horsepower each. At number 6 is the NH Industries NH-90. This was jointly developed by France, Germany, Italy, and the Netherlands. This helicopter is a medium-sized twin-engine multi-role military helicopter which was developed in response to NATO requirements for a battlefield helicopter capable of being operated in all weather, day and night operations in naval environment even during high sea states. Its advanced mission suite includes a 360-degree search radar, dipping sonar, forward-looking infrared, magnetic anomaly detector, and electronic surveillance measures. 
the helicopter can be armed with two Mu-90 or Mk-46 or Stingray ASW torpedoes. Number 5 on the list for the top 10 utility helicopters in the world today is the Augusta Westland AW101, which was developed by a joint venture between Westland Helicopters in the United Kingdom and Augusta in Italy. It is designed for search and rescue in anti-surface warfare and anti-submarine roles. Now, aside from its principal anti-submarine warfare role, the AW101 is also envisaged for utility and transport missions. The helicopter can also be armed with anti-ship missiles, air-to-air -air missiles, air-to-surface missiles, rockets, and gun systems. It has four torpedoes or depth charges in its weaponry. At number 4 is the Sikorsky UH-60 Blackhawk. This is a four-blade twin-engine medium-lift utility helicopter manufactured by Sikorsky Aircraft mainly for the U.S. Army. The Black Hawk helicopter's primary role is to transport troops and provide logistical support, but it may also be outfitted to perform medical evacuation, command and control, search and rescue, armed escort, electronic warfare and executive transport missions. Black Hawk has low detectability and is tolerant to small arms fire and medium caliber projectile. Using the External Store Support System or ESSS, the Black Hawk can carry 16 Hellfire missiles. The ESSS can carry a payload of missiles, rockets, cannons, and electronic countermeasures pods weighing up to 10,000 pounds. At number 3, we have the H92 Superhawk. This is an American twin-engine medium-lift helicopter built by Sikorsky Aircraft. It is a military version of the S-92 in the utility transport role, capable of carrying 22 troops. The Superhawk can be configured as a tactical troop transporter, an anti-submarine warfare helicopter, or a search and rescue or combat search and rescue helicopter. The helicopter features a spacious cabin, excellent survivability and long-range capability. The aircraft is capable of flying at any time of day or night and is reliable in all weather conditions. At number 2 is the MH-60R Seahawk. This is a multi-mission helicopter operated by the US Navy and manufactured by Sikorsky Aircraft. It is considered to be the world's most advanced maritime helicopter. The MH-60R Seahawk is equipped for a range of missions. This includes anti-submarine warfare, anti-surface warfare, search and rescue, naval gunfire support, surveillance communications relay, logistics support, and vertical replenishment including Lockheed Martin AGM-114 Hellfire anti-surface missiles. For anti-submarine warfare, the MH-60R can carry up to three ATK Mk-50 or Mk-46 active or passive lightweight torpedoes. And now at number one spot is the CH-47F. This is an advanced multi-mission helicopter for the US Army and International Defense Forces. The CH-47F Chinook is a heavy-lift helicopter with twin engines and tandem rotors created by American rotorcraft firm Vertel and manufactured by Boeing Vertel. It is among the heaviest lifting Western helicopters. It transports troops, artillery, supplies and equipment to and from the battlefield. Medical evacuation, aircraft recovery, parachute drop, search and rescue, disaster relief, firefighting, and heavy construction are some of the other roles. Aside from its principal transport role, it is also envisaged for other utility missions. The Royal Netherlands Air Force awarded Northrop Grumman a contract in May 2008 to equip CH-47Fs with the AAR-54 missile warning system. In January 2010, the systems were outfitted. CH-47Fs are equipped with three 7.62mm machine guns. And that's it guys for today. If you've enjoyed the video, don't forget to share and hit that like and subscribe button so we can continue making video for you guys. Thank you guys for viewing in. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.